Hi, I'm Philip Scott from Topicality and I would like to give you a quick introduction to this new service. Topicality is a new more efficient way to research and stay up to date with important news and information. It's designed for anyone that has to stay up to date to earn a living or has an interest they are passionate about. And that's just about everyone. So let's show you how Topicality works. When I sign in, I see all the topics I'm keeping up to date with. Today, I want to research the effects of climate change in Africa, so let's create a new topic. I give my topic a name. And I tell Topicality to find articles with the phrase climate change. and the word Africa. At the bottom of the screen, there is a handy tool, what this means. I use this to make sure everything is correct, and then I save the topic. When I have more complex queries, I can use the advanced Boolean option. It is ideal for researching multiple terms or phrases. If I was researching climate change and global warming in Africa, this is when I would use the advanced options. When I save my topic, Topicality immediately finds all the relevant articles for me and it will continue to find new articles for me until I tell it to stop by clicking on the delete button. This makes Topicality ideal for keeping up to date with things that are important to you. Today, let's see what it's found on climate change in Africa. The most recent and most relevant articles appear at the top of the page and there was a short summary for me to review and help me decide if I want to read the full article. When you've finished reading the article, you can return to Topicality. To really save time, I can teach Topicality what I like and what I don't. I simply click the up arrow for articles I like and it shows me any similar articles that are in the system as well. And I click the cross for articles I don't like. The more I do this, the more Topicality learns my preferences. The more clutter it eliminates for me, and the less reading I have to do. I can share articles with friends and colleagues by email. I enter my friend's email address and they receive an email with the article heading, my personal message and a link to the full article. I can also share the articles on Twitter. Topicality will post the article heading and a link directly to my Twitter account. Now that I've created my climate change topic, Topicality will continuously research the internet for me, finding new articles on climate change in Africa. The more I use the up arrow and the crosses, the better it gets at finding the articles that I like. To read these articles, I can visit the website at any time or simply wait for my daily email notifying me what's new. That's the end of the introduction to Topicality. I hope you enjoy using the system as much as we do and you find it an easier and more efficient way to stay up to date. Please contact any of our team with your questions and suggestions. We would love to hear from you.